Today we are going to learn 8th standard numbers example 1.16. The sum of two rational numbers is 4 by 5. If one number is 2 by 15 then find the other. When you add any two rational numbers your answer is 4 by 5. In that one of the rational number is 2 by 15 then we have to find the other rational number. Let the unknown number be x. So let x be here itself 4 by 5 be 5 be here itself. So when 2 by 15 when taken to other side becomes minus 2 by 15. To solve these two fractions here the denominators are different. So we will find LCM. Here the LCM is 15. 5 to become 15 into 3 into 3 and 15 to become 15 into 1 into 1. So 4 3s are 12 minus 2 1s are 2. So 12 minus 2 10. 10 by 15. So 5 2s are 10, 5 3s are 15, 5 5 get cancelled, your answer is 2 by 3. It is an important sum, it is repeatedly asked in your examinations. Next, example 1.17, same model, in the previous sum they have asked sum of two rational numbers, here product of two rational numbers. The product of two rational numbers is 2 by 3, if one number is 3 by 7, then find the other. When you multiply any two rational numbers, your answer is minus 2 by 3. In that, one number is 3 by 7. Then what is the another number? Let the unknown value be x. So, x is equals to minus 2 by 3 into 3 by 7. The relationship between x and 3 by 7 is multiplication. So, when you take to other side becomes division. The division number will become reciprocal. So, directly we will write the reciprocal itself. So, minus 2 by 3, let us write here itself. 3 by 7 becomes 7 by 3. So, here the cancellation is not possible. So, we will multiply directly gives you the answer. So, 2 7s are 14 divided by 3 3s are 9 minus I have written. Here it is plus minus into plus gives you minus. So, this is about your example 1.17. Now, our example 1.18. One roll of ribbon is 18 3 by 4 meter long. Shankari has four full rolls and one third of another roll. How many meters of ribbon does Shankari have in total? So one roll of ribbon means 18 3 by 4 meter. She is having in that four rolls and one by third portion of it. So when you multiply 18 3 by 4 into 4 1 by 3 gives you the total meter of the ribbon. So, 18, 3 by 4 mixed fraction we have changed into a standard. 18 into 4 plus 3 gives you 75 divided by 4. And 4, 1 by 3, 3, 4s are 12, 12 plus 1, 13 by 3. Here, 3 divides 75, 25 times. So, remaining is 25 into 13. So, 325 divided by 4 gives you, it is written in the mixed fraction, 81, 1 by 4. So, when you divide... 325 divided by 4, I have written the mixed fraction here, 81, 1, 1 by 4. Next to your example, 1.19. Find the rational numbers that should be added and subtracted so that they will make the sum to the nearest whole number. 3 1 by 2 plus 1 3 by 4 plus 2 3 by 8 to the nearest whole number. So first we will solve this sum. 3 1 by 2 plus 1 3 by 4 plus 2 3 by 8. First we will change all the mixed fraction into a standard form. 3 2 so 6 plus 1 7 by 2 plus 1 4 so 4 plus 3 7 by 4 plus 8 2 so 16 plus 3 19 by 8. Here the denominators are different. So we need to take LCM. The LCM is 2 into 2 into 2. 8 is your LCM. So, I have written 8 here. 2 to become 8 into 4 into 4. 4 to become 8 into 2 into 2. 8 to become 8 into 1 into 1. So, 7 4s are 28 plus 7 2s are 14 plus 19 1s are 19. So, the total of 28 plus 14 plus 19 is 61 divided by 18. 61 divided by 18 I have written in the mixed fraction. 7 5 by 8. Now, 7, 5 by 8, we are, we should add or subtract to make the nearest whole number. First, we are going to subtract. 
So, if we subtract 5 by 8 from 7, 5 by 8. Now, we are going to subtract 5 by 8 from 7, 5 by 8 to, the, to make the nearest factor. So, 7, 5 by 8 minus 5 by 8. 7, 5 by 8 means 7 plus 5 by 8 minus 5 by 8. Plus 5 by 8 minus 5 by 8 get cancels. So, the remaining is 7. So, the nearest the nearest number is whole number is 7. Otherwise, even you can do like this. 7, 5 by 8 minus 5 by 8. Change the mixed fraction into the standard form. 61 minus 5 is 56 by 8. 8 divides 56 7 times. Both the answers are same. You can do in any way. By subtracting, we got the nearest whole number. Now, we will add. If we add 3 by 8 to 7, 5 by 8, you will get the answer. See, here we don't want any number. If we add 3 with the 5 gives you 8. So, so that 8, 8 get cancels. So, if we add 3 by 8 to 7, 5 by 8. So, 7, 5 by 8 means 7 plus 5 by 8. Plus, we are going to add 3 by 8 now. Let the 7 be here itself. 5 plus 3, 8. 8 by 8. 8, 8 get cancels. And remaining is 1. So, 7 plus 1, 8. 8 is the nearest whole number. Otherwise, you can do like even like this. So, 7, 8 into 7 plus 5, 61 by 8 plus 3 by 8. 61 plus 3 gives you 64. 8 divides 64, 8 times. Even you can write like this. You should understand that 7, 5 by 8 means 7 plus 5 by 8. Thank you, children.